Welcome to Night Prayer with Father Matlack, your evening call to prayer. Pray with us every night, right here on the podcast and in your inbox. Learn more at goodcatholic.com slash night prayer. As we end our day, let's do so in God's presence and begin our night prayer. Jesus Christ, my God, I adore you and thank you for all the grace you have given me this day. I offer you my sleep and all the moments of this night. I place myself and all my loved ones, wherever they may be, in your sacred side and under the mantle of our Blessed Mother. Let your holy angels stand watch and keep us in peace. Amen. In praying, it's very useful to think about the power of God. So many of the Psalms, including Psalm 9, have phrases like, Arise, O Lord, lift up your hand, these expressions of power. We do this not because we are trying to goad God into be powerful, but it's because he is powerful. He's already won the victory, and we're getting in touch with his power. It's also to call down his power on, on our lives. The fact that we are dealing with so much weakness, our own weakness, the weakness around us, and sometimes it feels as though everything is lost. Everything seems to be lost. So much despair. So we call upon God's power. Arise, Lord. Lift up your hand. Do not forget the poor. Do not forget me. Of course, God doesn't eternally forget you. It seems as though he forgets you. It seems as though he's abandoning you to hopeless situations. So we call God, arise, lift up your hand. Your right hand is powerful. By the power of your hand, you created the world. By the power of your hand, you delivered Israel from their enemies. By the power of your hands, you have blessed us and called us into being. God's hands are capable of literally everything. And so we call upon God by that same power. Arise, bless us, and deliver us from all evil. Now I invite you to examine your conscience. Firstly, give thanks to God for all the benefits that you have received this day. Secondly, ask God for the grace to know your sins and to be rid of them. Thirdly, take an account of all the sins that you have committed during this day in thoughts, in words, and in deeds. Fourthly, ask pardon from the Lord for all the sins that you have committed. Finally, make a resolution with God's grace to amend your life. Finally, we end with the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thanks for listening today. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Night Prayer with Father Matlack is a production of Good Catholic, the media division of The Catholic Company. For more faith-filled podcasts and videos, visit goodcatholic.com.